What's up guys, it's your boy Darkskin, and today we are back with another Knights Chronicle video, and today we're going to be going over my uh, Ramu, because uh, ever since I started the game, uh, I bought Ramu, and I've been grinding to get all of her stuff and everything like that. So we're going to be going over her in this video, and then we're going to be doing some guild dungeons, because I need to do my uh, three dailies. Um, the uh, time just reset, so uh, that's really, really good. I can go ahead and get those out the way, and I don't have to worry about those. So, um, before we get into the video, make sure you guys like the video if you enjoy it. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and comment down below if you are new. Well, comment down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new, excuse me. Anyways, let's get into the video, right? Alright, so Hero Box. Alright, we're gonna be going over Ramu. So, this is my Ramu. Like I said, I, um... Matched out to level 50, and I limit broke her all the way to level 60. I don't have any purple stars on her yet, but I do have, <clears throat> I do have some Clarices to feed into her to get her her first two purple stars. I just haven't did it yet. Um, she doesn't have that much attack, but it's okay because she's a healer. Uh, it says she's a hybrid, but she doesn't really do too much damage. So you know, whatever. Her defense pretty good, and then I have um, almost 10,000 HP, which is pretty good too. Uh, where am I supposed, where am I trying to go? Oh, okay, no, hold on. Hero talents, boom. Okay. So anyways, uh, yeah, I have all of her talents. Um, these are the ones I chose. I have 50% chance to hide for two turns when using skill three, which is my ult. 40% chance to poison one enemy for two turns when using skill two, uh, which is my heal. And then 30% uh, chance to shock one enemy for two turns when using skill one, which is my regular attack. Uh, then my 56, I have decreased elemental damage taken by 15%. Um, I don't know how to level them up to like two stars and three stars yet. I'm gonna have to figure that out, but you know, whatever. And then, um, for 58, it's kind of weird. I was talking to a couple of my friends about this, but, um, it says increased damage dealt, by, um, in the arena. And then you have increased damage dealt by boss to bosses. Uh, but I decided to go with the cooldown one. Now, granted, the cooldown one says 3% chance or up to, what, 9% or 10% chance, uh, to decrease, uh, skill cooldowns by zero turns when attacked. Now, I know it says zero turns, but I'm pretty sure that's a typo because, uh, there's no way they're gonna have you, uh, you know, decreasing cooldowns by nothing. That's literally, that's dumb. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that that's a typo, uh... So yeah, I went ahead and went with it because I do want some cooldown reduction. And it's like, I'm not a damage dealer as it is. So I mean, I'm not really looking to do damage to, you know, in the arena or either one of those. So yeah. And then you already know her level 60 uh, talent. I revive one time with 100% HP upon death. So uh, that's my Rimu as far as that. My Rimu. Ramu, excuse me. Uh, I have runes on her, which I have... Uh, my uh i have this room gives her a little bit of attack but it gives her hp which is what i was looking for uh gives her some attack but it also gives hp which i'm looking for i'm, I'm pretty much looking for hp it gives a lot of hp recovery right there um this one was just a random room but it gives me defense which is really good so i put it on her uh this one gives me hp also and then this one also gives me hp with a little bit of other stats so um i mean i don't have a whole bunch of rooms so you know uh, I didn't have a lot of different choices to choose from, but I chose those because of those yes, reasons. Um, and that's pretty much it for everything I have on my Ramble and stuff like that. Uh, this is the team I'm rocking, which is nothing crazy. Uh, I have Mary and Rebecca both level 50. I haven't worked on them at all. Like they're, I just maxed their level out. That's it. And then I have a SR, which I haven't did anything for her either, which I should, but you know. Um, I get my free SSR tomorrow, so I'll be doing a video about that. Uh, tomorrow and uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into these guild dungeons and uh, do this. All right, so you ready? Shout out to the boy. Hold on, no, nah, time out. Are we gonna take wake list? Cause um... wait, is this Ashley? We take Ashley, hundred percent. A shout out to the boy wake list, but we gonna take Ashley. Uh, we might take him next time. I don't know. Okay. Uh, I gotta turn off auto. I have it on auto like all the time, so I'm gonna have to turn it off auto. Excuse me. Oh, it wasn't even on auto. Funny story. Okay, so. Oh, uh, we can just do reg well, his second attack. Alright, so we're going to be showcasing Ramu. So we're going to be uh, talking about a little bit of her stuff. So, uh, I need to go to her. I should have already. Wait. Okay, so, well, I can't get to, like, the screen. But you you, you guys get the gist of it. Uh, her passive, uh, after her turn, 
her and her whole team, they heal 10% uh, HP back. So that's a really good passive for her to have. Um, and then I can, on her um, first ability, inflicts damage equal to 100% of attack to one target, 20% chance to stun for one turn, which is really, really cool. It's her first ability, so nothing crazy. All right. Oh, and I got a uh, double attack off, which is really good. Then you saw everybody heal, uh, which is really good too. Who is this? Her? Just I'll do a regular attack with her. I don't really care about doing anything for these other people. Oh, okay, she got a double off, which is good. I really like Rebecca. I, I think Rebecca's pretty cool. <sighs> All right, going in stage two. So yeah, now that we got that out of the way, her second ability restores all allies HP by 20% and decreases their debuff duration by one turn, which um, it's a, it heals your whole team. And uh, my team doesn't really need healing right now, but I'll go ahead and do it for the sake of the video. Boom, it heals everybody for a pretty good amount. And I still get my passive heal off, which is pretty good. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. We should go attack. Oh, double attack. Good, good, good. Um, hopefully somebody dies in this. Actually, next time what I'll do is, um, what I'll do is I'll bring just the SR. I'll, I'll do that because the SR is gonna die pretty easily, right? And then um, I can bring her back to show you guys. Oh, her um. I can bring her back to show, unless it happens this one. It might happen this one, so we'll see. Maybe somebody will die. I don't know yet, to be honest. <laughs> I'm not doing my ult on purpose just so somebody might die. Because I don't want to kill her too quickly. Maybe she can. I feel like Ashley does a lot of damage, to be honest. I'm low key just about to have people defend just so like somebody could die. Oh, she attacks me. Okay. I don't really want to kill her. We're probably going to have to get go back in here. Yeah, we can go back in it and do one more cuz Ashley just yeah. All right, so what I'm going to do is uh I'm going to go back into a mission with uh like just the SR. No. Okay, next. Yeah, we'll just go in with the SR so, like, y'all can see it. Um, I don't want to waste my guild uh, dungeon. Because I'm, I'm planning on... Well, I'm not planning on losing, but I might lose. So, we'll just go to, like, a regular challenge or something. No. Uh, we can just go to a special dungeon or something like that. Go to whatever. Um, we can do a rune relic. Yeah. And then, uh, let me... Quick edit take her off take her off boom all right all right so this is what we're gonna do we're gonna go in here and do this like i said we're most likely gonna lose but that's okay i just want to show you guys what i'm talking about as far as her abilities so uh yeah and hopefully they target uh this sr and we can also show my passive too it'd be pretty cool I was about to say, like, do some damage, please. They're literally doing, like, no damage to me. Which kind of sucks. Like, I... <laughs> I forgot that, like, now that I have max talents, like, that elemental defense is really good, dude, to be honest. Can we, like, they're literally not attacking her, which is, like, yo. And then, like, my passive just keeps healing me. Like, literally, if they go. Well, I mean, uh, I'm sure the boss stage would be a lot better. Okay, multi-strike. What 
What's her ult do? I forgot. Oh, wow. I, I literally just healed. I did not know what her ult did. I did not mean to. Wow. Whoa. Uh, let's see what stage two has to offer. At this point, I'm just going to start defending. Okay. Okay, they're doing a little bit of damage to her. Well, now they're going after me again. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it, <laughs> guys. Because, I mean, I could easily go to, like, a really, really hard mission. But I don't know if I want to do that. Alright, well, um... I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna die because Remu just keeps healing. So I'll pretty much tell you guys what it does, and like you, you already you can get it from that. So, anyways, it says revives up the two allies and restores 40% of their HP. And then, like I said, her passive is um what's it called? Her passive after she dies, Remu comes back with 100% HP one time, which is really really cool. Uh, like I said, Remu keeps healing, so I'm probably not. I'm probably just gonna beat this anyway. But anyways, um, so that's going to be out there for her showcase and like her overview and stuff like that. Um, with that being said, be sure to give it a like, subscribe to, to the channel if you're new, comment down below. Tell me what you guys think about Ramu, if you guys like her, if you're going to go for her or whatever the case may be. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.